welcome to my channel. Hello kids! I'm your teacher Zell. Welcome to science class. Science 3. One, describe how we can make objects. And two, demonstrate how we can make objects move. Today, we're going to study about moving objects by wind. Match the pictures with the correct action words from the list provided. We have here A. Stretch B. Rest C. Block D. Tear D. Push F. Pull G. Flip H. Kick I. Roll J. Carry Here's number one. What is your answer? It's letter G. Flip. For today's lesson, you will make an improvised toy that can be by the way. to your hair or paper when the wind blows. Air is all around us and it is moving. Moving air is called wind. We can make things move. Now kids, let's read the poem. Peace. 
bow down. objects mentioned in the poem that move when the wind passes by. How did the wind make the toy car move? The answer is, the wind pushes the car. What are the some other objects that can be moved by wind? Answers, the flag on the pole is moving due to the wind. The branches and leaves are swaying because of the wind. The dried leaves or papers on the street move because of the wind. Very strong winds. Strong winds can move large and heavy objects. It can also cause harm to people. And property. During a typhoon, why do you think we need to stay indoors or evacuate during a strong typhoon? What can we do to stay safe when there is strong wind outside? You notice that your family's laundry line is set up on a calm day. Forecast predicts all strong winds will arrive later. Explain the potential problems the wind could cause and describe two practical steps the family should take to prevent their clothes from being blown off the line and onto the ground. Object move by pushing on them with a force. We have here a oh, direct push. How it works? It may, if wind molecules collide with them and shove an object, example, leaf blowing down the street. We have here the second method. We have leaf. Different air speed create the pressure difference, causing an upward force like a kite flying. Spinning and even pushing forces create a twist torque, a pinwheel spinning, and a 
energy transfer. We have wind moves one object, which the moon moves another, then moves another. Wind creates waves that move a boat. No. For the evaluation gets read each question carefully and choose the correct answer. For number one, which of these objects can be moved easily by the wind? A. A rock. B. A paper sheet. C. A chair. D. A book. What is your answer? Answer is letter B. A paper sheet. Two. What happens when the wind blows on a kite? A. Kite sink. B. The kite flies up. C. The kite breaks. D. The kite rolls. What is your answer? Answer is that are B. The kite flies up. Number 3. Which object? Toy car, D, a metal table. What is your answer, kids? It's letter D, a metal table. Four. Why can wind move some object but not others? A. Because the wind is hot. B. Because some objects are colorful. C. Because some objects are are light and others are heavy. D. Because the wind is invisible. What is your answer, kids? Answer is letter C. Because some objects are light and others are heavy. And last number five. Which of the following objects? A ball, B a pencil, C a book, D a spoon. What is your answer, kid? Answer is letter A, a ball. Now good job, kids. Thank you for listening. See you next time.